ஹாய் நீட் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் வெல்கம் டு வாரி மெடிக்கல் அகாடமி வாரி மெடிக்கல் அகாடமி சார்பாக அனைத்து விதமான டாபிக் சார்ந்த ஒவ்வொரு வீடியோவும் இனி வரும் நாட்களில் உங்களுக்கு வரும் உங்களுக்கு இதை சார்ந்த சந்தேகங்கள் கேள்விகள் எதுவாக இருந்தாலும் கமெண்ட்ஸில் பாஸ் பண்ணுங்க எங்க எக்ஸ்பர்ட் ஃபேக்கல்ட்டி மெம்பர்ஸ் போடுற வீடியோஸ் பிடிச்சிருந்ததுன்னா ஷேர் பண்ணிக்கோங்க அந்த வீடியோ ரெகுலராக உங்களுக்கு வரணும்னா சேனலை சப்ஸ்கிரைப் பண்ணிக்கோங்க தேங்க்யூ விஸ் ஆல் தி பெஸ்ட் yeah gaseous loss uh, already we discussed what are the uh, properties of the gas uh, density temperature volume pressure already discussed in uh, last class now gaseous loss write down what are the gaseous loss gaseous loss first one is the boyle's law boyle's law next one is charles law charles law next one is the gelusak's law gelusak's law next one is avogadro's 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 law i avogadro's hypothesis the gaseous loss pressure that is boyle's law charles's law gelusak's law avogadro's law in this boyle's law <coughs> first write down in this boyle's law what are the constants the constants are number of moles number of moles and uh, temperature is constant number of moles and temperature is constant and uh, in charles law and pressure is constant number of moles are constant pressure constant number of moles are constant next uh, in gelusak's law volume and number of moles are constant in avogadro's laws and pressure and temperature is constant pressure and temperature is constant here boyle's law at constant number of moles and mass of the gas is constant and constant temperature one by one we can explain now first one is the boyle's law it given amount of gas write down boyle's law boyle's law a given amount of gas given amount of gas at constant at constant temperature at constant temperature volume is volume of gas volume of gas inversely proportional to inversely proportional to proportional to the pressure of the gas pressure of the gas pressure of the gas now what is boyle's law a given amount of gas at constant temperature pre- temperature is constant number of moles are constant volume of gas inversely proportional to the pressure of the gas now write the formula v is inversely proportional to 1 by p now pv is equal to constant k pv is equal to constant here is a volume is inversely proportional to pressure when volume increases pressure decreases now pv is equal to k in proportionality constant remove that is equal to k now pv is equal to constant now write the formula p1 v1 is equal to p2 v2 these are the formula for boyle's law what is boyle's law a given amount of gas at a constant temperature volume of gas inversely proportional to the pressure of the gas now volume inversely proportional to 1 by p means it will be increases this one is decreases this one is given pv the proportionality constant remove that is equal to k pv is equal to constant now write to p1 v1 is equal to p2 v2 if you plot the graph if you checking plot the graph the gaseous loss boyle's law first one volume next one we can first uh, plot the graph between pressure and volume pressure and volume here volume and pressure or pressure or volume pressure and volume and this 
hyperbola rectangular hyperbola will come pressure versus volume if you i think this one is the t1 and next to this one is t2 and this one is the t3 which one is more temperature for example this is the 200 kelvin this one is 400 kelvin this one is 600 kelvin now t3 is greater than t2 is greater than t1 at a constant temperature means it is the constant temperature means isotherm in the pressure pressure on y axis and x axis volume rectangular hyperbola will come rectangular hyperbola will come the temperature t3 t2 and t1 next one is the pressure versus pressure versus 1 by v now straight line passing through the origin straight line passing through the origin that is equal to slope is equal to k here is constant temperature means isotherm isotherm now pressure versus 1 by v if you take another graph also pressure versus volume pressure 1 by v now now this one is t1 t2 t3 which one is more temperature we can write uh, t3 is uh, t2 and uh, t1 now pressure volume and next one is pressure 1 by v next graph is pv versus v it will be temperature is constant if you take uh, another one pv versus p it is also constant temperature temperature is constant next one is v is equal to k by p now apply the log now log v is equal to log a by b is equal to log k minus log p oh, sorry log p now we can write log v dash that is equal to this one is minus 1 log p plus log k this is similar to y is equal to mx plus c here is in y axis what you have take log v in y axis log v what is the slope minus 1 and what is the x axis log p what is the intercept log k if you plot the graph this one log v versus log v versus log v dash and log p dash this one is the negative slope it's showing negative slope slope is equal to minus 1 now intercept is equal to log k these are the graphs using for Boyle's law now pressure 1 by v and pressure 1 by v temperature t1 t2 t3 t3 is the more temperature these are the Boyle's law graphs it is useful for examination and next one is the Charles law write down Charles law in Charles law a given amount of gas a given amount of gas a given amount of gas at constant pressure at constant pressure volume of gas volume of gas is directly proportional to directly proportional to proportional to absolute temperature absolute temperature that is called charles law what is charles law a given amount of gas at constant pressure at constant pressure means isobar we can take volume of gas is directly proportional to absolute temperature now write uh, v is directly proportional to t v is equal to proportionality constant remove means k t now v by t is equal to k k is equal to constant 
Now write down V1 by T1 is equal to V2 by T2. This is the Charles law using volume is directly proportional to temperature. Now proportionality constant remove means K that is V is equal to KT. Now V by T is equal to K. V1 by T1 V2 by T2. We can plot the graph between volume versus volume versus temperature volume versus temperature it will be this is minus 273.75 next volume versus another graph also there volume versus temperature straight line passing through the origin now slope is equal to k now logarithmic graph log what is the formula v is equal to kt now log v is equal to log k plus log t you can take v versus log t to plot the graph between log v versus log t it will be slope slope of the graph what is the slope formula tan theta theta is equal to 45 degree now slope is equal to formula tan theta now theta is equal to 45 degree means that is plus 1 now slope of the graph is positive slope of the graph is slope of graph is uh, positive now what is the intercept log k is the intercept log k in this one also showing y is equal to mx plus c now log v we can write log v is equal to log t plus log t dash and log v dash plus log k in x axis log v take in x axis log v and y axis here is plus 1 plus 1 is the slope in y axis log t y is equal to mx plus c no? y is equal to mx plus c in y axis what we have take log v and slope is plus 1 and x axis log t and intercept is log k these are the charles law we can use it next one is the gelusak's law what is the gelusak's law this one is the pressure temperature law pressure temperature law gelusak's gelusak's law this one is the pressure temperature law another name is pressure temperature law now <coughs> a given amount of gas given amount of gas at constant volume at constant volume pressure is directly proportional to pressure directly proportional to temperature again proportionality constant remove p is equal to kt now p by t is equal to k constant now p1 by t1 is equal to p2 by t2 these are the gelusak's law the same we can plot the graph between pressure versus temperature pressure versus temperature straight line passing through the origin now this one is the iso core at constant volume at constant volume means this is called iso core the same we can plot the another graph also log now what is the formula p by t now p is equal to kt now log p is equal to log k plus log t now log p dash now this one log t dash plus log k the same graph will be happening like uh, charles law now log p on y axis and x axis log t it will be slope of the graph the theta equal to 45 degree now theta is equal to 45 degree the slope is positive only and this one is the 
गेलू साक्सला ए गिवेन अमाउंट ऑफ गैस एट कॉन्स्टेंट वॉल्यूम प्रेशर इज डायरेक्टली प्रोपोर्शनल टू टेम्परेचर प्रेशर पी इज इक्वल टू के टी पी बै टी इज इक्वल टू के नैक्स्ट वन अवेगैड्रो ला वाट इज अवेगैड्रो ला लास्ट वन इज अवेगैड्रो ला अवेगैड्रो ला वाट इज अवेगैड्रो ला इट सिमिलर कंडीशन आफ टेमपरेचर प्रेसर equal volume of the gas contain equal number of molecules and moles now volume of the gas directly proportional to number of molecules now v is equal to k n now v by n is equal to k write down next one v1 by n1 is equal to v2 by n2 This is the Avogadro's law. What is Avogadro's law? At similar conditions, at constant, at constant temperature and pressure, equal volume of the gas, equal volume of the gas, equal volume of the gas contain equal number of equal number of moles or molecules not atoms molecules and moles this is the avogadro's law avogadro's hypothesis at constant temperature pressure equal volume of all the gases contain equal number of moles and molecules v is directly proportional to n V by is proportional to constant remove is equal to V is equal to K n. V this one is coming this side means V by n is equal to K. V one by n. These are the Gaussian law, Boyle's law, Charles's law, Gelu-Sarkis law, Avogadro's hypothesis. From we can take first one uh, serial number number of moles. Next one is temperature, pressure, volume. For example, if in Boyle's law, if you take Boyle's law, Boyle's law, Charles's law, Boyle's law, Charles's law. Next to Gelu-Sarkis law, Gelu-Sarkis law, Avogadro's hypothesis, Avogadro's hypothesis. Now, what are the parameters we can use? So number of moles of the gas, temperature. प्रेसर वॉल्यूम इन बॉइल्स ला वाट आर द कॉन्स्टेंट नंबर ऑफ मूल्स दिस इज कॉन्स्टेंट नेक्स्ट एंड एट टेम्परेचर आलसो कॉन्स्टेंट दीज आर द कॉन्स्टेंट एंड प्रेसर वर्सेस वॉल्यूम प्रेसर एंड वॉल्यूम रिलेशन इफ यू टेक चार्लेस ला नंबर ऑफ मूल्स आलसो कॉन्स्टेंट here is temperature is not constant temperature versus pressure is constant next to it will be temperature and volume temperature and volume if you take gelu sarkis law number of moles is equal to constant now here is volume also constant now temperature versus pressure temperature versus pressure If you take Avogadro's law, pressure is constant, and uh, next one, temperature also constant, and volume, number of moles or number of molecules we can take. These are the Boyle's law, Charles's law, Gelu-Sarkis law, Avogadro's. What are the parameters actually? We can any gas. These are the parameters: number of moles, temperature, pressure, volume. If you take Boyle's law, number of moles is constant, temperature constant. When temperature constant means isotherm. If pressure is constant means isobar. If volume is constant means that is isocore. These are the Boyle's, Charles's law, Gelu's law's law, Avogadro's hypothesis. These are the gaseous laws useful while you are doing graphical representation. and the formulas are 
important thank you for